Well, thanks to a federal ruling, UP electric consumers may soon pay more for or may, may, pour, pay, may pay 100% of We Energy's Prescott Power Plant's operating costs. That's $116 million, and it could show up on bills beginning December 1st. So what does that mean for your electric bill? Tonight in part two of his series, TV6's Nick Brennan explores what new power company and power consumer energy costs might look like for you and what percentage of the plant's costs We Energies believe the Upper Peninsula should really pay for. Upper Peninsula power companies haven't completely figured out possible rate raises for customers as a result of the Federal Energy Regulatory Commission, or FERC's, current energy ruling, but it mostly depends on where you're located, which power company you use, and how much power it draws from the Presque Isle power plant. The Marquette Board of Light and Power runs off its own power supply, so they say bumps in their customers' bills will be very minimal, 5 to 10 percent at the most. UPCO will be paying just over 5.5 percent of the costs, and they've given an example of the average residential customer using 500 kilowatt hours of power, seeing a monthly increase of $5.50. Cloverland Electric is one of the hardest hit companies, paying 20 percent of the costs, or $22 million a year, with average residential customers possibly getting a rate raise of $600 more per year year and $6,000 more per year for small businesses. Michigan leaders, including Governor Snyder and Attorney General Bill Schuette, are trying to convince the FERC to reconsider their ruling. We don't believe it's fair, we don't believe it follows the historical precedent, and fundamentally we just think it's wrong for Michigan ratepayers and it needs to be changed. For their part, We Energies has filed to the FERC that Upper Michigan should pay a much lower percentage of the cost than 100 percent, but says that all customers in the region who benefit from the plant should still pay something. Whether you're a choice customer or not, a choice customer, you are benefiting from the running of the Presque Isle plant and therefore you should pay for the benefit from that. Uh, so ultimately what it, would, what it would boil down to is in our plan it would be 17 percent to Michigan. In the meantime, We Energies has requested that the FERC delay the ruling past December 1st to provide more time to try and improve the situation. Nick Brennan, TV6 News, Marquette.